welcome to my channel commerce education today we shall discuss uh, section 92 of income tax act this section deals with uh, computation of income from international transaction having regard to the arms length price this section uh, specifies how to uh, determine the income from international transaction income from international transaction uh, considering the arm lens principle subsection one of this section that means uh, section 92 of income tax act subsection 1 states that income arising from international transaction from an international transaction shall be computed having regard to the arms lens price arms lens price that is a uh, fair market value and the explanation of the subsection states that the allowance for any expense or interest arising from international transaction shall also be determined shall also be determined having regard to the arms length price subsection 2 of section 92 states that wherein any international transaction or specified domestic transaction two or more associated enterprises enter into mutual agreement or arrangement for allocation, apportionment, contribution, any cost or expense incurred to be incurred in connection with benefit service facility provided or to be provided to any one or more of such enterprises the cost of allocation the cost or expense which has been allocated or apportioned or contributed by any such enterprise shall be determined having regard to the arm's length price of such benefit, service and facility. So when two or more associated enterprises enter into mutual agreement or arrangement For allocation, apportionment, or contribution of any cost or expense for any benefit, service, facility to be provided or provided to any or more of such enterprises, the cost or expenses allocated, apportioned or contributed by such enterprise shall be determined having regard to the arm's length price of such benefit, service, or facility, as the case may be. 
subsection 2a of section 92 states that allocation for expenditure or interest or any cost expense or any income in relation to specified domestic transaction specified domestic transaction shall be computed having regard to the arms length price having regard to the arms length price so in case of specified domestic transaction also same principle are followed subsection 3 uh, states that subsection 3 of 92 states that the above provisions above provision that means the provisions of this section of this subsections shall not apply in case in case what is the case where computation of income where computation of income in subsection 1 that means this one this one in subsection 1 or subsection 2a or determination of allowances of expense or interest under subsection 1 or subsection 2a for the determination of cost or expense allocated apportioned as the case may be in subsection 2 that means this one or subsection 2a that means this one has effect of reducing income effect of reducing income chargeable to tax or increasing loss or increasing loss has effect of increasing loss computed on the basis of entries made in the books of account made in the books of account in respect of the previous year in which international trade or specified domestic transaction was entered into so in this case the above provisions shall not apply what is the case if the above provision has effect of reducing income chargeable to tax or increasing loss computed on the basis of books of entries made in the books of accounts Thank you.